everyone, welcome to another video with EREC. Um, today we're going to be doing a few little stretches that you can do in your home um, between uh, work breaks, Zoom meetings, all the things that we're trying to adapt to during this time. So we get really tight in our lower backs from sitting a lot and our hip flexors get pretty tight and also causes our hamstrings to get a little bit um, tight. So let's work on stretching those out, just a few little stretches that you can do um, in the comfort of your own home or outside or wherever you see fit. So let's take a deep breath in, let's inhale sweeping arms out and up towards the sky. Let's let the ribs lift. So think about creating distance between the rib and the hip bone. Find a big stretch, just like you're trying to touch the ceiling. Inhale through the nose as you drop one arm down. Keep that same big lift of the ribs, really opening up the side body. Practice a breath here, inhaling to expand the lungs and exhaling as we reach the arm back up and bring the arm back down. So you can continue to do these side to side, as many as you want to do. Sometimes going longer feels a little bit better to open up the rib cage, those intercostal muscles. Let's do one more together. Nice deep breath in and coming all the way up. Let's press our hands down and away. Turn the palms in facing each other and imagine you're squeezing a ball behind you to open the chest. So rather than squeezing the shoulder blades together, let's bring more awareness and focus to the front of the chest, the collarbones, um, the heart shining up towards the sky. Taking an inhale through the nose, let the chest open and lift. And then exhale, release, and come back to normal. So those are two really good stretches that you can do at your desk at home um, in between Zoom meetings, like I mentioned, uh, just taking some time for yourself. The other area that gets really, really, really tight are hamstrings. Lots of different ways to stretch hamstrings. We know that stretching a leg out in front is a perfect way. So here's how I like to do a hamstring stretch. And I'll turn to the side. So the right heel or left heel will come forward. You'll hinge from your hips. Notice I'm keeping a flat back and I'm continuing to pull my chest forward and my hips up towards the sky and flex the toe towards the shin. Soft little bend in the knee. That's gonna create dynamic tension all the way up the leg. Once again, taking a deep breath in through the nose and let it out through the mouth and just allow that hamstring to relax into the stretch. All right, so we unhinge from the hips, we switch legs. Take the other foot forward, come from a hip hinge, keeping the back nice and flat, keeping the hips lifted, toe lifted, nice stretch in the back of the leg, taking a deep breath in through the nose, and then letting it out through the mouth, coming all the way back up. So that's your hamstring stretch for today. And then one more stretch I wanna show you guys you can go near a wall if that's more comfortable. If your balance is a little off today, um, definitely put your hand on a chair. We're gonna pick one foot up behind you, the quad stretch. Now we've all probably done a quad stretch before, but I wanna give you a couple of tips and pointers moving forward. So we can reach back and grab the foot. We wanna make sure the ankle is nice and strong. So if I bring my foot back, let's flex the foot. That will engage the glute to get us into a deeper stretch and then tuck the tailbone under. So not a big tuck under, just a light little drop of the tailbone. So a little tuck under, engage the core, relax the shoulders, keeping the knee pointed down, and of course, taking a deep breath in through the nose and letting it out. Okay? So those are a couple of stretches that you can do. They'll help you to build a little energy to increase um, your focus. And I just encourage you guys to try that throughout the day, maybe every hour jumping up from your desk, at home, from your couch, if you're working on your couch, wherever you may be to try those uh, couple of exercises. Once again, my name's Whitney, and we miss you guys at the rec center, but we'll see you soon.